And we're back, and it's time to fight Gizora. Gizora. Gizora again. Gizora. Gizora. Mendoza. Oh dear God. Oh God. No, no. Okay, here's the thing. Um, yesterday oh. I went. Um, the other half of couples play, who uh, will periodically be in episodes here, uh, Sylvie and Gabe. Uh, I went to uh, our local record store, and the girl there was. Uh, playing uh, episodes of the simpsons uh good episodes of the simpsons so it's the one where uh bart and homer make a uh, soapbox derby uh, racer <laughs> they go to the video store because it was a cheap excuse to um spend time with lisa and they get there and they watch in a clip of uh, mcbain <laughs> and it was the whole it ba mcbain's partner basically jinxing himself by getting shot and he's just like yeah on two days from retirement uh, little Susie's growing up. It's like, yeah, and me and the wife are about to christen the new boat and steal the country. And the name of the boat was Live Forever. <laughs> and then Buddy gets shot to shit. Like, a hundred rounds put into him before Bane finally pulls out his six-shooter and just starts firing a few rounds into nothing. <laughs> and the guy's just, like, bleeding out like crazy. Just like, damn, damn, damn. McBain, I gonna make it. Oh, stop talking crazy. <laughs> just do one thing for me. Get Mendoza. Mendoza! The whole time I'm watching this, this is so meta because, like, he's Homer's watching this on um, a video screen at a video store, and I'm watching it on a video screen at a video store. And the guy Talk goes, about a role reversal. He's like, Would you like to write it, sir? It's like, Why? I just saw the best part. <laughs> and then I remember, there's, I don't think it's on YouTube, but it's on the internet. Somebody took every single, like, uh, one off clip of McBain. And strung it together in one video, into one movie. Because <laughs> uh, there is a beginning, a middle, and end. It d the movie doesn't make any sense in the l grand scheme of things. And I'm getting <gasps> my ass handed to me in the corner here. Uh, but it's so funny just to watch like all those he clips. Looks like he mm, looks like a Gizora was tickling a <laughs> Godzilla. Unfortunately, they didn't put in the Nazi Kami. Uh, uh, clip <laughs> where uh, McBain fights uh, Nazi commies. <laughs> Basically, it was like Russian flag with a swastika. Oh dear God! <laughs> he like busts out of a plane on fire. <laughs> He's like, I surrender. Not today. <laughs> he breaks his neck. <laughs> Ice to see you, <laughs> McBain. Mm. I think I think uh, the Simpsons should do like a complete spinoff where it's just Rainier Wolf Castle. Just have one episode and make it a McBain episode. Uh, they are already working on a Lego episode. Uh, no, I think that was just an opening. No, it's actually a full It's a full episode? episode? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, well, basically Lego paid them for it. Well, yeah, like, they're gonna come out with Lego Simpsons soon, so... Yeah, so... An interesting tie-in. I would almost love, like... That's one of the series, like, I'd love to see, like, a, a Lego game made out of Lego Simpsons. And like have every episode or every 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 mission or level based on an episode of the of the show. You know, well, the here's si the thing: right in the show, the uh, Legos are a little bit different than the ones that we get in action in uh, real life. <laughs> they could have a radioactive man level, uh, a radioactive man comic level, where the boys, <laughs> like you, you and the co-op player, have to collect enough studs to buy the comic. And then you have to do mini missions to keep it from ripping. But That'd then be it, awesome. But then it game. eventually rips. Like, we work so hard and it's all gone. And all because the three of us couldn't share. What's your point, Bart? <laughs> Nothing. Just really pisses me off. <laughs> That'd be kind of cool if you could put the expand, like, not the expanded, but like the, the expanded characters in there. Like, it, you know, plays Itchy and Scr Lego Itchy and Scratchy or. Or Lego Radioactive Man, R Lego Fallout Boy. <laughs> Mel has his Fallout Boy. Where's Fallout Boy? <laughs> and you can play Rainier Wolf Castle either as himself or, um, or McBain or Radioactive Man. Up and at them. Up and at them. Up and at them. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Ah, da, 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 da. So much life that thing takes away. Oh god, oh god. Achoo! 
getting so leveled up, it's crazy. I honestly think, though, that, uh... I think Mothra levels up on his own. It's one of those Nintendo tropes that, like, it's probably all explained on them in the manual or Nintendo Power, and I just don't bother to read. I learned on my own. Like, playing TMNT, you, uh, learn that your power, uh, the power of your weapon doubles when you have half of your life gone. But I don't think they even tell you that in the instruction manual. It's just one little happy surprise. Yep. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Eww. I still can't. I'm still gonna have to go looking online about that angry. I mean, not angry beaver, but that mad beaver up in Miramichi. Mad beaver? Wait, what, what are we getting on mad beaver about? What are you talking about? Uh, just trying to change the subject. <laughs> All right, okay, what's I'm, a mad... I was talking to, it about, to uh, Sylvia about this, and honestly, I just thought, that, like, what? Okay, really? what's, a, hey, what's a mad beaver? <laughs> mad beaver terrorizes a small town. <laughs> um, I know how a small town gets revenge. <laughs> End of mad beaver. No, that's true. But it was... <laughs> From what I've heard, I'm like, it sounds so unbelievable, I couldn't believe it. And I'm like, yeah. It's so unbelievable that you couldn't believe it. It was. That's so, what it makes so it unbelievable. It sounded far fetched until I started seeing like a few photos, and I'm like, really? Far fetched. Far fetched. And you're teasing me, obviously. <laughs> he's a he's a Pokemon. <laughs> what the heck is that? A smog monster. His name's Hidora. Jeez, he looks a lot uglier than the thing. It's clobbering time. Oh, wrong thing. No, but the swamp, swamp thing. thing. Put you in the face and uh, choo. Jeez, uh, oh, every time uh, you uh, get in uh, Godzilla spinning his tail, it reminds me of that those uh, skip it things. <laughs> you mean those, those stupid plastic things you would put around your ankle and just yeah. like stuff around? <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I'm skipping. Before. Oh, no, I don't know fine. what happened to it, but I think it broke. I think it went to the landfill with all the other uh, horrible 90s fads. Mm. It tried to get kids into shape. <laughs> yeah. Uh. Eh. 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 My tail will hurt you. Yeah, there we go. There you go. There you go. Godzilla tea bag right there. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> All right, now time to go into the bubble world. Wait for the future. Bubble world. Well, it's just like all these. Uh, they have like uh, domes on them. No, not these. I hate these freaking fire things. It takes so much health away from you. Oh god. Oh god. E -e. Do 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 do. So wavy. Those look like Sundays on a plate. Mmm, <laughs> Sundays. Can we? Oh, we don't have any ice cream. I was just like, can we have Sundays? <laughs> and one Sunday is so good. Taka oh. Hello, can Godzilla go? <laughs> Hello, can you go? Oh god, that was one thing. They were trying to get me. Were they trying to get you uh, to do the uh, the limbo on our uh, pirate dinner uh, no. theater group? No. Okay. Because they had like a limbo set up. I think after that, that's when we did all the dancing. It's like, okay, we interacted, we danced. I really have to fucking pee. I need to go to your washroom. <laughs> which you obviously don't have on this pirate ship. So I'll have to wait until we get back. <laughs> Alright. Ouch. <laughs> oh! You got no choice but to get hit by that. I swear to God. Ah, kick you in the face. Got We're still that. on Jupiter, right? Yeah, we are still on Jupiter. Okay. Yeah. And I'm surprised, like I say, that's your favorite Sarah Scout, and I'm surprised that we have not you have not pre ordered uh the SH figure arts uh still Jupiter figure yet. Uh well <laughs> got let me just pay off a few things first and then I'll see if I can uh Oh, it's only like what 30 bucks 30 40 bucks mm. not that big of a deal true that's no, better than waiting until whatever uh, comic shop decides to get it in on their area 
I suppose, but still, some of them will offer it for very reasonable prices. I like to start getting those uh, SH figure arts Mighty Morphin figures. What the heck is go what happened to Godzilla? You look like he glitched. Oh, I'm uh, punching while squatting. And it just, like, forces his animation back up. Yeah, let's take it all out one shot. Rah. Rah. Yeah. Did you ever watch the Godzilla animated series that came out after uh, the movie? I tried, I think. I do remember watching that Kong thing that they came up and I'm oh, like, God, really? This is horrible. Yeah. Did I tell you ever I, I met the uh, the voice actor who played uh, the Matthew Broderick character? Mm -hmm. um, he's actually a uh, Beverly Hills 90210 uh, alumnus. Uh, Ian. Ian Zirging? Zirging? Uh, I don't remember how to pronounce his last name. And apparently you get right, he gets right I now, mean, you do don't even know. I don't even watch 90210, so... Anyway, um... I, um... I'm not a soap opera person. It was, this was before I met, we, we met, uh, and I was still, like, heavy into the clubs. Apparently he was in town to film a, a short movie, which I really hope was Sharknado, <laughs> because... <laughs> But the, the time frame doesn't seem right for that. But uh, yeah, he was fil he was filming a movie here, and uh, um, I was just hanging out with my friend who was uh, working a uh, coat check, and uh, I was just like not like you know doing anything. Like I was didn't want to drink and anyone and like party or try to hit on girls or anything like yeah. that that night. So I was like, oh, I'm just gonna hang out here for a while. And then all of a sudden he walks in and is just like, the fuck, man? He's just like. I was just like, oh shit, you're the guy from uh, Now 2 -0. What's going on? <laughs> Quick conversation. He like he gave me his ID to check. He's like, every the funny thing is, is like I was hanging out and everyone thought I was the doorman because like I was wearing I was I was wearing a black shirt. You know, most security guys wear black shirts, so people were showing me their IDs. <laughs> it's just like, shit, I'll roll with it. It's like, yeah, yeah, go in, yeah, go in. <laughs> Doesn't matter. <laughs> Yeah, they he has a bouncer. You were a bouncer. Oh my god, that is so cute. <laughs> you almost said cute. I was just like, yeah, me a bouncer. That's cute. That I said cool. Correct as yourself. Cute. <laughs> Caught myself. It's not cute. Yeah, but I still think you're cute, honey. Damn right you do. <laughs> I can never see myself being a bouncer at a nightclub. That's like some shady shit there. Yeah, uh, yeah. Well, at least I'm glad you don't have it. Never gotten the job that gotten you uh, injured in the process. Uh, I came close. Uh, now you th you'll laugh at this, and it was data entry. But here's the thing about this data entry thing, is that I was scanning stuff like I had to sit in a cold uh, warehouse uh, in front of a computer that was like not even a 386; it was a 186. It came in three shades of green. Oh my god. Yeah, that old. And, like, you know, basically scan stuff and send it off. My brother worked there, too, but he was, like, one of the guys that would, like, lift stuff off pallets and shit. He told me many a tales of how many broken flat screen TVs um, he would ship off to, like, Future Shop and shit. Because they would drop them there. And, of course, they don't, they don't ever check... Uh, the contents when they uh, get it there so it's like customer's responsibility to be like hey if you get this tv home and it's broken you gotta take it back oh okay i hate this this thing goes off for like a split second into uh and you gotta hit it right in its sweet spot but just just with mothra and get that in there uh and he leveled up Oh, we're almost there. Almost done. This planet. We got many more to go. Um, I'm trying to remember what other plants are on here. I know Uranus is in here. <laughs> Sorry, I always have to laugh when I hear yeah. that. Yeah, just don't point that smell scope at Uranus. <laughs> I don't get it. Sorry, Fry. Astronomics renamed your name about a hundred years ago to finally put a nail in that joke once and for all. Oh, what did they name it? Eurectum. Here, have a smooth. Ah, no. <laughs> I 
God, I miss. I, I actually, I, I was gonna say I don't. I I don't miss Futurama. I, I do in the early season. I never watched the new ones, the ones that were on Comedy Central, but you know, it's it's time that it went to rest. I mean, some shows can't stay on the air forever. I know. Which one of the, okay? What shows actually? Maybe that's a better uh, discussion for next time on Couples Play, because it's yeah. time. It's time. time it's for time. What? It's Vader time. 